Charlie Lapson here in Hollywood getting the tips from all the stars on how they're getting ready for the Oscars. So let's talk about your personal style. What kind of products do you use? Your skin care, your hair care? How do you look so fit? Tell us what your regimen is. I try to eat healthy, fruits, vegetables. Uh, lean protein. I train hard. You know, I try and take care of myself and run and play tennis. Skin care, I, you know, I'm a guy, so I kind of just go for whatever is closest, you know, whatever is easiest and most convenient. Natural is better. My hair kind of does what it wants. Uh, my mom gave me her Texas curl, and I try to not tell it what to do, but let it do what it wants because it always wins. I like a lot of vintage um, things that have been worn that are soft and broken in. I think a lot of the new cool fashion that people are really into, uh, some of the high-end stuff, they're, they're trying to make it look distressed, make it look old, and there's a huge premium for that now. Do you ever pay people to wear your clothing for you first? <laughs> no, but I, uh, but I am known to put it through the wash several times in order to try and, you know, uh, distress it myself. Things that have um, been worn and come from maybe another history of style, uh, whether it's the 70s, 60s, you know, even the 80s, uh, you can find things that... Uh, have already come around that you can make your own today and uh, you can find them in uh, great prices and good deals. A lot of things, in, we were talking about New York and Brooklyn, they've got a lot of great, wonderful vintage. But when you're not casual and you get a little dressed up, what might it be that we see you in? Oliver Sweeney, here one of the people, they've been very nice to me. Robert Graham is really great. I've worn some of their stuff. I've always been a fan of Ralph Lauren. They do really nice high-end stuff and they also do the, the casual distress stuff really well. You pay a premium, but it's worth it with Ralph Lauren. Someone's going out on a hot date, they just got a call, and they got accepted for a date. And they don't know what to do, they're not stylish, they have no clue. What does he do? Did you meet this person online? <laughs> call your mom. No, I'm kidding. So you definitely want to uh, do what makes you feel good about yourself, and if that's something that you wear every single day, then wear that on the first date, because, you know, uh, it's not always about trying to impress. It's, it's just about being yourself and hoping that's enough. Exercise tip. Run. <laughs> People have said, um, you know, that uh, the elliptical runner is great because it's uh, low impact, but uh, I can't really stay inside when I run. I like to not be in the same place, so I like to go run hills and run outdoors and just be outside. Nature is, has a wonderfully motivating factor to it. Are biceps important? Sure. I mean, push-ups, you know, push-ups and pull-ups, I think. Anything you're using your body weight with is pretty much the best workout you can do. Okay. Thanks very much for your time. It was great.